Hi students, in last class we are discussing about divisibility rules. In that we have completed rule for 2, rule for 3 and rule for 4. Okay. What is the divisibility rule of 2? To divide with 2 the given number must be an even number. So, 2 third divisible of value and manana then given number mana kitchen number twenty number kachatanga could even number I on the So even number lay than a la check chest them. A kitchen number and every even number lay than a la check chest them nana by seeing its units place. Okay. Units place of the number contain 0 or 2 or 4 or 6 or 8. If five digits lo yedo ka digit unnan konna na it must be an even number. It must be an even number. Ledu e number ledu e digits levu ante it will be an odd number. Odd number two to divisible avvadu. Okay, that is the divisibility rule of two. What is the divisibility rule of two? The given number must be an even number. Okay, even number or ledu naara decide avtham by seeing its units place. Okay, units place of 0 or 2 or 4 or 6 or 8. If 5 digits low, this <coughs> digit contain it must be an even number. So it will be divisible by 2. Okay, that is the divisibility rule of 2. Very simple divisibility rule of 2. Next, what is the divisibility rule of 3? What is the divisibility rule of 3? Tell me that. The sum of all the digits, the sum of all the digits in the given number. Man, kitchen at twenty number lo unna digits na net ne kuda add chhe lana. For example, three hundred and sixty nine. This is the number they have given. E number lo unna digits na net be three six nine. E three digits ni sum chhe lana. Three plus six plus nine. Three plus six plus nine. The sum of all the digits, whatever the digits presented in the given number. Each number lo unna twenty digits na net ne kuda sum chhe lste. I will 6 plus 3 plus 6, 9. 9 plus 9, 18. Is that 18 is divisible by 3 or not? 18 and 3 is divisible by 3. Yes, it is divisible by 3. So, it, the given number 369 is also divisible by 3. Clear? That is the divisibility rule of 3. Okay. Next, coming to the next, what is the nana? divisibility rule of 4? Next one anti divisible rule of four. What is the divisible rule of four? The last two, two digits of the given number. Last two digits of the given number is divisible by four. Last two digits of the given number is divisible by four. Then whole given number is divisible by four. So what are the last two digits here? Last two digits are sixty-four. Six and four. So sixty e two digits four to divisible I te. If two digits are fourth or divisible I te, then the whole given number is divisible by four. So sixty four and the fourth or division yes, sixty four to sixty four ni fourth or division yes, four ones are four, we get the two and we need to borrow, we need to take that four. Four six are twenty four. Okay. We are we have got we got zero as remainder. Zero as remainder means that sixty four is completely divisible by four, which means that three thousand seven hundred and completely divisible by 4 it is the divisibility rule of 4 no, no. if the number is divisible if the last two digits of the given number is divisible by 4 then whole given number is divisible by 4 that is the divisibility rule of 4 very very important no, no. The, all the divisibility rules are very important for future okay for signing school exam and entire maths future is also important up to intermediate we require this divisibility rules okay that's why please be concentrated Okay, all the concept what we are discussing in this science school examination will be very useful for the entire maths future. Now, and I, my sixth class is coach to seventh class, eighth class, tenth class. In any class, it is very very important topics. These are the very important topics. So please concentrate. So next one is divisibility rule for five. Rule for five. Rule for five. So before going to discuss about the rule for 5. So rule for 5 discussed here and contain Mundu. So let me th tell that what is the 5 table Nana. 5 table this kundama. What is the 5 table? 5 1s are 5, 5 2s are 10, 5 3s are 15, 5 4s are 20, 5 5s are 25, 5 7, 5 5 6s are 30, 
फाइव सेवन जार थर्टी फाइव फाइव एट जार फोर्टी फाइव नईन जार फोर्टी फाइव फाइव टेन जार फिफ्टी ओके हिर् वी नीड टू काट्रेट अट दूनिट प्लेस यूनिट प्लेस काट्रेट चयी यूनिट प्लेस काट्रेटे वी आर् गेटिंग ओनली टू डिजिट वाट आर् दोस् टू डिजिट ओके जीरो आर् फाइव 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 जीरो फाइव जीरो फाइव जीरो फाइव जीरो फाइव जीरो फाइव जीरो only we get 5 or 0 so that is the divisible rule of 5 that is the divisible rule of 5 idena divisible rule of 5 a number which contain 5 or 0 a number which contain 5 or 0 in its units place then it should be divisible by 5 okay a number which contain Zero or five in its units place, then it should be divisible by five. Okay. A number which contains zero or five, zero or five. इकड़ो नल लाना in its units place. A number which contains zero or five in its units place, then it should be divisible by five. Okay. Let's see. Let's see some problems related to divisible rule of five. Okay. Check the following numbers are divisible by five or not. Okay, following numbers are five or divisible out there. Let us check check it. Let's see some question. Okay, these are the given questions. Let's see that first question. Children, know what they have given. The given number is four thousand eight hundred and ninety. The given number is four thousand eight hundred and ninety. At which place we need to concentrate here? We need to concentrate at units place. Units place lo zero kaani, five kaani. Unte it must be divisible by five. So units place lo yamundna na zero. In units place we are having zero. So zero means that it will be divisible by five. So in units place we are having five. So it is in, in units place we are having zero. So it will be divisible by five. Four thousand eight hundred and ninety is divisible by five. By five. The next question. What they have given, Anna? The given number is five thousand six hundred and three. Five thousand six hundred and three. Look at the denominator. Let's look at the units place. In units place, we are having three. Okay, three. Unna Anna. Manak e mundi ali zero or five matra me mundi ali, but we are having three here. Three unte Anna. It is not divisible. Only zero and five unna pur matra me divisible Anna. So five thousand six hundred three is not. Divisible by five. Five is not divisible over the because it contains the it contains three in its units place. Okay, next question. 
what they have given on a the given number is 7985 so look at the units place in units place we are having 5 units place lo manake em undana 5 undi so it must be divisible by it must be, must be divisible by 5 5 undi nana 5 or 0 maatrame undali manaku 5 undi kabatti okay it will simply divisible by 5 so 7985 is divisible by 5 next question what they have given anna given number is 6554 6554 again look at the units place again look at the units place in units place we are having 4 in units place we are having 4 4 unnana 4 unte unnana which is not 0 or 5 man 0 or 5 matre undali kabatti 6554 is not divisible by 5 clear this is the divisible by rule of 5 okay the given number must contain 0 or 5 in its units place in its place lambda na 0 or 5 okay next coming to the rule for 6 divisible by rule for 6 rule for 6 what is the divisible by rule of 6 ఇక్కడ సిక్స్కి ఏం చేస్తామంటే నాన్న వీ హ్యావ్ వీ వీ హ్యావ్ టు టేక్ ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ ఆఫ్ సిక్స్ సో సిక్స్కి ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ ఏమవుతాయంటే ఓకే టూ ఇంటూ త్రీ టూ త్రీ జా సిక్స్ తీసుకోవచ్చు కదా సో దట్ ఈస్ ద డివిజిబుల్ రూల్ ఆఫ్ సిక్స్ నాన్న ఇఫ్ ద నంబర్ ఈస్ డివిజిబుల్ బై టూ అండ్ త్రీ అంటే ఏంటన్న టూతో త్రీతో డివిజిబుల్ అయితే ద నంబర్ ఈజ్ డివిజిబుల్ బై సిక్స్ ఇఫ్ ద నంబర్ ఈజ్ given number is divisible by 2 and 3 2 and 3 two numbers tho kuda divisible avvali 2 and 3 then whole given number is is divisible by 6 divisible by 6 that is the divisibility rule of 6 nana if the number is divisible by 2 and 3 2 to 3 to divisible avvali okay let's see that some problems Check the following numbers are divisible by 6 or not. Okay. So, let us see some problems related to this. Okay, look at look at this these are the questions okay and and what is the given number the given number is the given number is 6834 6834 in this what we need to check we has to we need to check with the number is divisible by 2 next what we need to do we need to check with the number is divisible by 3 ila prathi okka question ki we need to check that 2 nana either it is divisible by 2 and 3 2 to 3 to divisible avvali 2 to divisible avvali ante enna na the given num, given number me must be an even number 6834 is an even number because 6834 is an even number because it contain em undu nana units place lo em undi manaku 4 units place lo 4 undi kabatti it must be an even number kabatti 2 to divisible avutundi 2 to it will be divisible next 3 to divisible avvali ante enna na sum of all the digits 6 plus 8 plus 3 plus 4 6 plus 8 plus 3 plus 4 
6 plus 8 14 14 plus 3 17 17 plus 4 21 21 is divisible by 3 or not yes 3 to 21 divisible out on look at the divisible table of 6 the number should have 6834 has to be divisible by 6 means that we need to check that number is divisible by 2 as well as the 3 so 2 to divisible out on because it is an even number even number cover 2 to divisible out on the next what is the divisible rule of 3? The given number must be an even number. So, the given number the given number loan digits and it may could add the given number loan digits and it may add chest. We got the 21. 21 is divisible by 3. So, totally the 6000, the 6834 is divisible by. by divisible by 6 okay divisible by 6 next one same what is the given number the given number is 9848 again we need to check with the first change we have to check with the 2 and we have to check with the 3 okay 2 to 3 to render to check chairlana so what is the divisible rule of 2? The given number must be an even number. So, given number is an even number. Unit space for only 8 on the cover, it is an even number. Cover 2, it will be divisible by 2. Next, what is the divisible rule of 3? 3 and 3 and divisible rule sum of all the digits 9 plus 8 plus 4 plus 8. 9 plus 8, 17. 17 plus 4, 21. 21 plus 8, 29. 29 is not divisible by 3. 3 3 to divisible avat ledu 2 to divisible ayindi kani 3 to divisible avat ledu nana okka number to divisible kaakapoyina kuda 9848 is not divisible by by 3 not divisible by 3 clear next coming to next what they have given a given number is 6,397. Direct manage 6,397 is not divisible by not divisible by 6. Indukusa direct because okay, 6 6 we are checking with the divisibility rule of 6. 6 to divisibility rule check chase at up do the given number must be an even number, even number. I under. Can I mean, which number? Eighty six thousand nine hundred seventy ninety seven is an odd number. Okay, that's why we have to. Okay, directly said that. We are directly saying that it is not divisible by. It is not divisible by. Okay, six. Next rule for eight nine. Rule for eight. Sir, why there is no rule for? 7. So, rule for 7 and the is the rule for 7 and the is complicated. Na na. A rule for 7 is the direct division is better. Okay, rule for 7 is the direct division is better. That is why we are ignoring the rule for 7. Next, we are going for the rule for 8. So, what is the rule for 8? So, rule for 8 and rule for 4 and the is similar. Count na na. Rule for 4 and the last two digits. Rule for 8 and the ante, the last three digits the last three digits of the given number given number is given number is divisible by 8 8 then whole given number is divisible by 8 very important and divisible root of 8 and divisible rule of 9 ok one thing is important so what is the divisible rule of 8 if the last two digits last three digits no, no. last three digits if the last three digits are divisible by 8 last three digits of the given number is divisible by 8 then the whole given number is divisible by 8 
ఇక్కడ ఏంటంటే ఏంటన్నా లాస్ట్ త్రీ డిజిట్స్ని ఎయిట్తో డివిజిబుల్ చేయాలి ఇఫ్ ద లాస్ట్ త్రీ డిజిట్స్ ఆర్ డివిజిబుల్ బై ఎయిట్ దెన్ ఫోర్ గివెన్ నెంబర్ ఇస్ డివిజిబుల్ బై ఎయిట్ నన్న సో లెట్ సీ దట్ Draw the questions are Okay, these are the questions they have given Okay, what is the first question, Anna? The first question is 6,992. 6,992. What we need to do here? Last three digits. What are the last three digits, Anna? 992 has to be divisible by 8. The last three digits is 8 to divisible by 8. Then entire given number is divisible by 8. So, 8 to division, Anna? 992. So, 8 ones are 8. We get the 1, 9. So, 8 twos are 16 because 8 threes are 24 got 8 twos are 16. You get the 3, 2. 8 fours are 32 na? 0. We got the 0, right? So, 0 is the number. 0 remainder is the number. It is completely divisible by 8 or not? Yes. 6992 is divisible by 8. By 8. Clear? Next. What do they have given? Anna? Given number is 7,894. Again, last three digits. What are the last three digits? The last three digits are 894. Has to be divisible by 8. 8 to division jayari. Okay, without remainder. When the remainder is 0, say, it will be divisible by 8. Remainder is 0, it is not divisible by 8. 8 to division jayari. 8,904. So, 8 ones are 8, we got the 0, but we have to register 9, 8 ones are 8, again 1, 4. So, 14 is not divisible by 8, 8 ones are 8, you get that 6 and 8 reminder, 6 and 8 reminder, it is not completely divisible. So, 7894 is not divisible by 8 divisible by 8 that is the divisibility rule of 8 now coming to the next question what they have given the given number is 8643 that is again your question 8643 is not divisible not divisible by 8 because 8,643 is an odd number, 8 is an even number, even number to check chai set up to the given number must be an even number, akad odd number unte it is not divisible, okay, odd number unte not divisible and jepes tham nana, next coming to the today's topic, final topic is rule for 9, what is the divisibility rule of 9, so what is the divisibility rule of 3? 3 ki divisible rule of n divisible rule end na sum of all the digits same rule is applicable for the 9 also akkada manam 3 tho divisible chestam ikkada 9 tho divisible chestam that is the difference that is the only difference in between rule for 9 and rule for 3 so what is the divisible rule of 3 the sum of the sum of all the digits the sum of all the digits the sum of all the digits in the given number in the given number is the sum of all the digits in the given number is divisible by 9 then whole given number is divisible by 9 then whole given number is divisible by 9 ok that is the akadayan nana divisibility rule of 3 and t the sum of all the digits the sum of all the digits 
or divisible by 3 then whole given number is divisible by 3 ekkada enti divisible rule of 9 enti the sum of all the digits in the given number is divisible by 9 then the then the all the given numbers are divisible by 9 Next question should no, no, no. see the sum questions on divisibility rule of 9. The sum of all the digits. Let us see some questions on divisibility rule of 9. Okay, look at this question. These are the questions. Let us see sum of all the digits. What they have given on a given number is 8694. Sum of all the digits 8 plus 6 plus 9 plus 4. So, 8 plus 6 14. 8 plus 6 14. 14 plus 9 23. 23 plus 4 27. Is the 27 is divisible by 9 or not? 27 and 9 are So, yes. Yes. 8694 is divisible by 9. Divisible by 9. Same as is ekkada kuda nanna. Sum of all the digits. What they have given nanna? Given number is given number is okay. Let's take this. 7969 seven nine six nine okay seven nine six nine seven thousand nine hundred and sixty nine sum of all the digits seven plus nine plus six plus nine seven plus nine sixteen sixteen plus six twenty two sixteen plus six twenty two nana twenty two plus nine twenty two plus nine it will be thirty one twenty two plus nine it will be thirty one thirty one is not divisible by nine it is not divisible by nine nana. so 7969 is not divisible by 9. Same as the third question. The third question is 99963. Same divisibility rule of 9 apply and do that. It is check, check that it is divisible by 9 or not. Okay. These are the divisibility rules for 5. 6, 8 and 9. These are the divisibility rule rules. Okay. Please. If you are not understanding these divisibility rules, please again watch the video. video You get the clear idea. Okay. At least 4 times my video ni watch ali. Watch as you get the clear idea nana. After that you can write into the class notes. Mere onga questions is coach. Mere onga practice for chess coach. So this is all about today's class. In next class we will complete all the divisibility rules. Thank you guys.